<laughs> oh hey guys, it's me, Gracie, and welcome to another episode of Gracie Versus! On today's episode, I am in my bedroom. Just joking, I hate her. We are currently backstage at a club called Lalo, which is actually, fun fact, where I did my first ever live show. Come with, I'll show you around. It was uh, 2020 January. I was ready to go on my first ever headline tour just after, and then everything shut down. Last that for us, but today I'm not here to sing. I'm here to learn how to do something else. And I have a very special guest to help me do it. Today's episode of Gracie Versus is DJing with Nathan Dodd. So I'm here to teach Nathan how to do it. It's a big joke. Wrong. I decided that my new hobby uh, that I'm gonna try to do is DJing. And who better to teach me than one of the best UK DJs in town? Where is he? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> He's the tallest fellow I've oh, yeah. ever met. How tall are you? I'm 5'5". Five five. Oh shit. So pretty much the same height. Yeah, I'm 6'6". Yeah, six, six, yeah. so All right. Terrible. The Peter Crouch of dance. Man, like, oh, yeah, so true, so true. Football reference, I know it. <laughs> So, we are doing that today, by the way. I know you're going to try and get me to do this. I know you what you you've oh. just done it. So, <laughs> when did you start DJing? When I was not, I think. Well, you know, when you've got a camera. I think you talk to the camera, or talk to you. I'm going to do both. Do both. Um, when I was nine years old. When you were only six one. I was six two. Oh, ah, yeah. six one when you were um, amazing. No, I was nine amazing. years old when I got my first Dex. Right. And my mum and dad got me some Argos Dex. That's a very kind present. Yes, it was, and then I couldn't get off it. Then I was just no. addicted to that. You've been doing it for three years then, because <laughs> you, you just died uh, 13. Oh, shit. Yeah, clearly. Well. <laughs> It'd be four. 27, so how long is that? 18 years? Gracie versus is maths. Is it? Pending. Is it 18 is years? It 18 years? Nine. Clarible, nine, though. <laughs> 18, 18, years, 18 years, 18 years. We knew that. She's probably retired now, shouldn't I? Yeah, but <laughs> really? no. It's a long stint. So, what have you got in store so, for us? Obviously, there's a lot of different ways to DJ. Could be so. vinyl, could be CD, could be memory stick. I choose Serato, which people that are watching this that might understand the DJing scene will know what it is. If you don't, it's basically like a laptop program that stores all your music. And um, it's just a lot easier oh, to like sick. navigate through different folders, yes. genres. Because I'm multi-genre, so I play a bit of everything. Oh, Sometimes okay. I'll draw for Tommy Kitten, mm. and then give it to a bit of Gracie. Yes. Ooh, and a bit of Darude Sandstorm. What goes up in the club the most? Well, it depends what club you're in. So true. <laughs> so true, Oh um, my god. Oh, I was wow. playing the other week in Liverpool, and I played Wonderwall, Oasis, and then I let them all sing the chorus, so I put the fader down. Then I went into Mr. Brightside and with the do 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 do, it absolutely went mad. This guy knows. So I'm going to play something and show you how yeah, it's done, and you're going to try your a, best. I think that's a great idea. You show okay. us how it's done. I'll just, I'll just okay, dance okay, alone. Okay. A club for one. <laughs> they said no clubs allowed, and I said I don't think so. Play the track. <laughs> oh, Quite easy, isn't it, really? <laughs> Gracie versus dancing more like. Jeez, big clap at home! Woo! I didn't like the second song, but really good. I think you should just try it. Oh, where do I start? Like, oh, that, 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 just that, try that, it. That's the content right there, isn't it? Round one. Okay. Choose two songs, choose two songs. So I think we'll go for. Way too long because it's a bot and you should stream it now. How do you go about choosing one to mix into? What so, would you say uh, is good? So, do you want to get geeky with it? Mm. Yes, please. So, BPM, beats per minute. Yes, ma'am. So, way too long has got 125 beats per minute. To make it easy, you kind of need to go for anything between 130 and 120. Okay. To mix in. Nice. Otherwise, it's going to be too hard. Yes. And no okay. one likes hard work. So, basically, we're looking for something around the same around tempo. Around the same tempo. Okay. Maybe we should do like a classic. Got do, you have, do you have Britney? Britney? Do you have any Britney? Because I feel like I'm giving Britney energy. I, 
When you have some of love, you gotta turn the shit up. Left hand side, Nathan Dorr and Marie, most that way too long. Right hand side, yes. the business. So which one do you want to play first? Uh, let's play yours first. Okay, so you need to put that fader on. Okay. And then click play. So we want to have like one headphone off, one on. It's about that call you want to lock. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> so. I took oh, the joke too far, I took the joke too far. I can't have hairs in my headphones. We need to try and match them numbers. So right. one, two, five. One, two, one. Right. So in order to do that, yes. you're going to need to use this little nice. thing. Okay. <laughs> to match the numbers. So you see on there, one, two, one. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You need to try and get it to match one, two, five, point okay. one. Bring that up. <laughs> we'll get there. We'll get there. Oh, yeah, just try. That was a bad first start, we're gonna fix it. Breaking the equipment now. You don't need any of it. We're gonna stick him down, Jordan. Is it in beat? Yeah. yeah? Definitely. Yeah. So on this next one round, press that one. Let's get down, let's get down to business. So back in the day when I used to have to do like nightclubs, well I still do nightclubs, that's my job. Um, like bars, oh, weddings, and you got to do like two for five yeah. cocktails at the bar, oh, or like Jager bombs, three for a tenner at the bar, yeah. get your drinks in, two pina coladas for a tenner at the bar. Let's get down. For the next ten minutes. Two pina coladas. What? Everyone's going to what are you doing? <laughs> You just press that as and when you want. Oh. Obviously, try and keep it in beat. Live shows. Yeah, we'll just like get on my head. No, no, like an actual DJ set. Yeah. A bit like Craig David, TS5. I think that would be really, really fun. Would you guys enjoy? I think you would. Write it in the comments. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Let us know down below. So just try mixing. For sure. Final round. Maybe we'll fix this or maybe we won't. Sometimes a heart can sink like a stone. Time. What? Is that sound in time? Do you sound in time? I think so. <laughs> no. <laughs> Do it on this drop then. On the drop. Press that on the drop. One, two, three, four. Okay. That made up slowly. Now fast up.
best one yet. That was good. I mean, I didn't do that. Let's be realistic. The majority of DJing is just trying to look like cool at. Well, that if that if that all is, then this is a definite win. <laughs> what would be your end of night tune? Incredible questions. You're asking the right things. I'd do the really sad slow one that everyone could go home and cry to. I would do Robin dance on my own. Oh my god, beautiful tune. That's a that's a ten out of ten song. That's how I would end the evening. Everyone, go home and cry. Get lost, <laughs> but also dance. Oh my god, we have our first fan. <laughs> <laughs> I hate that. I hate that girl. Right, look, this is mine. What a beautiful song. Oh. It does work. Incredible. Look, I feel like you've had quite a good DJ masterclass. Thank you. This was this has been an absolute ten out of ten experience. I feel like that was really that's a new career path for me. So it's so much fun. But how do you think I did, Nathan? It was really good. Really good. It was good, yeah. It was like, look, you're a beginner, you were learning over the first time. What's about beginner? <laughs> she is. It's pretty, so, pretty um, pro. For the first time, I think it's a patch, you did well, yeah, yeah. You yeah. did, you so, learned. In the case of Gracie versus DJ Gracie. For a number, I'm gonna give it Oh <laughs> just a win or a lose, but oh. that was good. <laughs> I'm gonna give it a winning 7.5. It's a celebration! <laughs> it's a bubble five! Gracie wins, everyone! <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm extremely sweaty. Big up Nathan Dawn for teaching me how to DJ. That was really fun. Genuinely quite tempted to get a deck. I'm gonna make it into a 10 out of 10. It's gonna be a great new skill, and then we can all get crazy and very drunk in the club while I spin um, this song. So it's now time for Gracie Recommends. My first recommendation of the week is going to be watching the football with your friends and a nice cold beer. Um, not usually a football person, but I do enjoy the vibe. And I think it's fun that loads of humans just watch a screen and or a pitch and can just happily cheer on people running around a field. Next up, I recommend, actually, I'll play you a little bit. There's a new artist called Maya. And she has a song called Swing of It Things. I've been fucking with this very hard. I think she's a really cool gal, so check her out. My last recommendation are cherries. I think it's cherry season. I don't know. Cherries are fun. Now it's time for what's your latest question? First up, we have Elle, who's asking. <laughs> First up, we have Elle, who's coming at me with. What's one hobby you've picked up uh, from someone and can't get rid of? No, me and my friends are absolutely awful for this. At the minute, I keep fucking curtsying. <laughs> How do you do, madam? Yes, I'm Madam James. Hello. Yeah, I guess curtsying. But I, I know Keep really think we should try and make it a thing. <laughs> Lucy asks, if you were stuck in a parallel universe where the theme was a TV show, which TV show would it be? 100% Sex of the City, but instead of New York, it would be uh, London, and instead of Carrie, it would be Grace. Instead of a column writer, I would be a songwriter, and I would be the friend that is just there for fun. Just there, just there to irritate everyone and curtsy um, and get everyone kicked out of the club. <laughs> What's a secret conspiracy you would like to start? There was a period of time where I liked to pretend uh, in clubs that Nigella Lawson was my auntie. It's not true. It would be great. I'd get her to cook me some couple of dishes up in the microwave, aren't they? Yeah, it's unfortunately not true. Spread it about. Anyway, that's it for this episode of Gracie versus. Give it a like, subscribe, follow me on Instagram at Gracie with an EY, and have a great, stunning week. Me, oh, and um, uh, questions down below. <laughs> Millie gets angry if I don't ask you that. So, uh, Jay, give me your questions down below. Uh, weirdest questions. Anyway, <laughs> love you so much.